Uh oh, it appears that the doctor prescribed some disrespect as Dr. Disrespect claims that Xbox ripped Ninja off and bringing him over to Mixer. Let's get into this juicy, juicy business. What's up, peoples? What's up, peoples? What's up, peoples? It is your boy, MM2K, back again with another one. Do me a favor, y'all. Hit that like button. Hit that subscribe button. Rock those bells for notifications, please. So you know when your boy's dropping these doses. I appreciate all of y'all straight up, because you know the deal. I am not too proud to ask. Okay. Now, what's going on, you say? Well, it appears that... The homeboy Dr. Disrespect sent out a couple of claps at your boy Ninja that transported over here to Mixer, you know what I'm saying? I say here to Mixer like I'm partnered with them or something, but you know, people are excited. Even though I get it, this is not the type of exclusive <laughs> material that Xbox really, really needs, but the whole pickup of, of Ninja altogether got a lot of people excited. All right, so again, as we know, Ninja, a prominent Fortnite streamer, left Twitch, the biggest game streaming site in the world, to join Mixer, a little known site, <laughs> you know, with maybe 10% of the population, if even that, and it's thrown the whole game streaming world in an uproar. Well, now we have words from another prominent Twitch streamer, which is Dr. Disrespect, and he claims that he knows some information that we all might be interested in. So let's look into what he might know. Okay, so I want y'all to take a look at something. Now this comes via Dexerto.com. And in the uh, article it says, Dr. Disrespect's claims Ninja was ripped off with Mixer Deal. And he says, quote, I know the number. All right, so the article reads, Dr. Disrespect Rip Ninja's decision to take his stream exclusively to Mixer, calling it a bad move, as he claims to know the numbers that made him go. And it's not clearly enough, all right? Even with the questionable bans and the frequent backlash from strange marketing decisions, Twitch is still the undisputed best place to stream community, stream to a community, but that hasn't stopped competitors like Dbrand and Mixer to try to break Twitch's hold on the market. The biggest move so far was Mixer's play to take Ninja away from the platform for what everyone assumes to be a large stack of cash. But even still, the doc thinks the numbers don't add up for what Twitch has to offer. Okay. So, quoting Dr. Disrespect, he says, am I the only one that's gotta say it? The doc started. I'm the only one that's got the guts. It was a bad move. It was. For Ninja, it was a bad move. I'm surprised. The article continues to say, the two times seems to know some insider information on the deal between Mixer and Ninja. He's convinced that even with everything that Mixer might have offered the popular Fortnite streamer, it still doesn't make up for what Twitch brings to the table. Dr. Disrespect continues, I know his number. Dr. Disrespect said, I know what it is. Ninja, he should have stayed here. You should have stayed here, Ninja. I would have allowed you to stream with me too if you would have stayed. Like, I would play with you, but you left. You left me. <laughs> so here, here, here's how your boy MM2K sums up all the, the, the crazy stuff here. Because I saw this and I was like, my, oh my. Um... Dr. Disrespect, and I'm not big in knowing these guys, you know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm going off of the, 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 the faint imagery that I have. But Dr. Disrespect, not too long ago, directly after Ninja's move to Twitch, or to Mixer, excuse me, said, I wouldn't mind going, was a very infamous uh, statement that he made, made headways. And everybody was like, uh-oh, the exodus might begin. And it was a bunch of other Twitch streamers that said, uh-oh, I'd be willing for a deal too. But here's the thing, you have a lot of salty people too. You know what I mean? That were, that were mad and upset that the biggest streamer, which was Ninja, left the platform, went to Mixer. He felt like that he's gonna take all the fame and glory with him and leave them high and dry. 
Here's the thing though with Dr. Disrespect, how this all connects to him. Mixer may have done a move of all moves. They might be willing to throw money to make the platform more prominent, but I guarantee you this, there is nothing in the world that would have Mixer carve out a deal for Dr. Disrespect, okay? <laughs> and I think that has finally hit home for the streamer and now he might be a little salty, you know what I mean? I mean, this is the same cat that went into the bathroom over at E3 and was being warned and didn't listen heed the warnings. It's just, that is beyond the realm, beyond the guardrails that Microsoft is willing to hold up. You know what I'm saying? To me, I, I think this is just some, this is some salty aid that your boys pour out in the glass for everybody to, to sip and opine on. But again, that's just me. Again, I'm not the biggest follower. Maybe some of you guys that are listening, some of you guys and girls that are that partake into, you know, this Fortnite streaming or whatever these guys do, you have a better understanding. So let us know what you think in the comment section below. You know what I'm saying? Because like I always tell y'all, who cares what I think, okay? So leave us something, because that's it from your boy. But if you did like what I had to say, I'm on the corner of every boulevard, baby. Even about this Fortnite stuff. Even about these salty tears that Dr. Disrespect might be handing out to everybody who's still eliminating the summer. Lemonade is a popular drink and it still is. But let me not go too far in the weeds. Hey, yo. If you did like what I had to say, like I just said, I'm on the corner of every boulevard. Check out the links below to follow me. Hey, yo, I do a show with your peoples, Dirk Griggity, Snow Bunny, Neethals. It's called Scram Punks. We air it every Wednesday, 9.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time on Dirk Griggity's channel. Check out hashtag Scram Punks for more information on that. Check out my brother in the broadband bullies. We got her doing the damn thing. You know what I'm saying? Check out that Discord link. Check out the link to the Patreon. Check out the gear because it's fly. Check out the FN production show, the greatest new show out out here on the internet it is called the best god dang on podcast okay i butchered that all up it's called the best damn podcast with that being said check it out me nethels my man j dub and the one and only next year 720 and we're going to be joined by your boy well i'm not going to say nothing i'm not going to say that that's going to be a surprise with that being said Check me out on the HNDC, the Hard Knock Digital Culture, out on twitch.tv with your man Salty Tears, Dr. Disrespect. And with all that being said, now with all the citations and all that stuff done, you guys have a wonderful gaming day. Peace.